All right, so I wanted to see what all the machine has me do with uh, cleaning the steam wand. So if I press the start button, it's actually still going to override this error message down here and brew a ristretto. So it's telling me to go to maintenance. So if I scroll to maintenance, hit the start select button. Oh, actually, hit the select button here. And let's find clean steam wand. There we go. 10 minutes. Let's select it. Remove the pin cleaning tool. All right, so the pin cleaning tool, if you haven't seen my video, I discovered this by accident, um, hidden beneath the water tank. So here's the, the uh, pin cleaning tool. Just a uh, plastic handle with a little um, metal pin. All right, let's see what it says next. Unscrew and remove the steam tip. So now we want to go ahead and take the cap and internal pieces of our steam wand uh, off. Um, the on-screen instructions will tell you to unscrew this. You want to make sure you're screwing it to the right counterclockwise. I know it's counterintuitive to the old righty-tighty-lefty-loosey, and it took me a while to figure that out. So turn it right. Now what should happen is that this metal cap should come off with this black piece at the same time. Unfortunately, in my case, it did not. So what you're gonna have to do is also turn this black piece to the right. Now, when I first attempted to do that, it was in so tightly, I had to use a piece of paper towel to not damage the plastic and some pliers and lightly also turn this to the right. Um, just be sure you don't flatten or damage any of the screw uh, ribs, otherwise you're going to have an awfully hard time and possibly damage um, damage the plastic and not be able to get your cap back on. So once that's loose, you go ahead and pull that out. And what that's going to do when you pull it out, it will go ahead and any gunk or milk that's in here, um, inside of the steam arm itself, you'll see uh, come out on here. The next step uh, to clean this is that you want to remove this white o-ring and check it and make sure that it's not dry rotted um, and that it's clean. You also want to check your black o-ring here and make sure that it's clean as well. You want to take your pin cleaning tool and insert into each of the four holes and clean um, any residue that's in each of these four holes with the pin. Once you're done with that, go ahead and insert it back on the base. Put your water tank back. You want to go ahead and wipe all of this down. You can rinse it in the sink. I've already done that. Um, make sure you get any and all milk off. Go ahead and put your cap back on. Again, you want to turn this to the left counterclockwise and then that will go ahead and be reinserted back into the steam arm and that turns to the left as well to tighten it. And just hand tighten it, don't go crazy with it because otherwise you're going to have an awfully hard time. The next time the machine prompts you to clean you're going to have to use the pliers again. So hopefully um, you won't need that if you only hand tighten. And then once you're finished with that, go ahead and allow the machine to finish with a steam purge. And that's it. Your steam wand is now clean. If you like this video, give a thumbs up, share, subscribe, comment. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank <laughs> you.